Hey viewers, welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander Saga, The Darkest Dawn. Do use your tip. Attacking heavy fighters and torpedo bombers from the rear probably isn't the best approach of attack, since they got weird turrets and all. Yeah, well, I'm a slow learner, so what are you gonna do? Sweeney! On we go with the Freya campaign. Things aren't getting any easier, that's for sure. Time is short, so I'll get to the point. The fleet's in trouble. It's coming down to a game of numbers, and the Kilrothi's is getting the upper hand. Not much more to say beyond that. We need something fast to buy time, and HQ has several diversionary ops that will split the Kilrothi's attention elsewhere from our main forces. Our objective is Freya 2, the planet closest to our jump point to Kilroth. Previous strikes have taken out the shield generator, but there's still a Kilrothi base and contingent on the planet. Admiral Merkin is about to take a bold step to take and occupy the planet. This would give us space superiority over the jump point, which leads straight to Kilroth. As of now, this is a marine operation involving the 1st and 5th Marine Divisions. The Hermes will provide air support and general overwatch. Our Marines will drop here at these regions and take the planet. Our intel analysts said that this will definitely divert the Kilrothi's attention because they know that if we occupy the planet, we can lob missiles, pot shots, everything, including the kitchen sink, each time they jump in reinforcements. The Marines will be digging in deep, and we can expect the Kilrathi bombardment to be just as brutal as what they did at Vukar Tad. Several wings from our unit have already launched, and they are busy running interference for us as we speak. Alpha Wing, me, Sandman, Twilight, and Grey Wolf will support the Hermes. We will take off from the Hermes and rendezvous with the troop convoy at NAV-1. We will then escort the landing craft to the planet at NAV-2, where we will drop into the atmosphere at this entry point. Once we enter the atmosphere, we will take up overwatch position high above the planet and cover the other assault waves as they come in. We will loiter until the area is secured. Once that's done, we will get back into space and return to the Hermes. Our time is running short, but we'll get this done. You launch in 15 minutes. Oh good! Now we get to export... export. Now we get to escort super vulnerable marine transports in an atmosphere. This is gonna be fun. No, you know what? Good! Good! I'm Alpha excited! Wing, you are clear to launch! I'm excited! Let's do this! Yes! Super fun time! Alpha Wing, good luck! The orbital bombardment is currently underway. Check in with your convoy's flagship, the assault transport Lewis B. Puller. Any word on Bravo and Charlie Wings? Heavily engaged. By all accounts, they're doing well. As they should. Out. Ah, uh, entering a planet in combat conditions. You just sit there and pray you don't burn up on re-entry while the flight control system hopefully compensates for the atmosphere, barometric pressure, and all those little minute details. Hey, Sandman? I've flown in an atmosphere before. I don't think it's such a big deal. Don't get cocky, kid, just because you're in an Excalibur now. I remember when you were in diapers and training wheels. Don't worry, he still is. <laughs> Good luck down there. Okay, let's move, people. Proceed to next waypoint. I do love little tidbits like that. Like that, like having Kettle throw that in there. Just so you know he's still around and flying off the Hermes. It really makes the game feel more immersive. Fuller Control checking in from the Hermes. More fast movers. Good to see you. The first wave of dropships are launched. You guys are going in with them. Switch to their frequency 4-5 Alpha Charlie Papa. Switching 4-5 Alpha Charlie Papa Alpha 1. This is the captain. All personnel prepare to drop second wave in five minutes. Chaos 1 to Marines. We are the first wave. More cats for us to kill. You smash that entire area and dig in. You kill anything that has fur, you get me? Isn't that... The Commandant, leading from the front. Well, looks like the stories about him are true. Fighters, this is Chaos One. Your job, and only job, is to support my Marines. Everything else is secondary. Chaos One out. Okay. Do you need to comment quickly on one of the names of these ships? The Arlie Emery? Emery? I always mispronounce that. But that is the name of the drill sergeant in Full Metal Jacket. There's Chaos 1. There you go. Whee! I'm sure 
shoulders names are significant, but I have no idea how. Autopilot they're. link established. Proceed to next waypoint. All right, time to defend some flying boxes. How many people can they possibly fit on those ships? They're not very big. Time to go. Okay. I shouldn't bother targeting you. Break it! Don't get cocky. Although missiles hurt just as much from these guys as bigger ships. Fly like the deep that you are. Stop laughing at my shit. Man, man, you got a bogey on your six. Head, bud. Okay. Do, 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 do. Still magic speed. That's good. That still hurt a bit. Oh, one of the ships is right down to 39%. That's kind of awful. Actually, you guys are being dueled pretty well. I think I'll just go hang out here. Hey. Venom, this is Charlie Wing. We're picking up massive readings on Long Range Raider. There's something heading your way, and it's called trouble. Phalanx, can you reach them? Negative. We're still heavily engaged. Now I've got some damage. Avatar's shields have short-circuited. Psychopath's losing fuel. We need to disengage soon. Roger, Phalanx. Wipe out your friends then, RTB. Keep me updated with nav readings on those contacts for as long as you can. In progress? Alpha, this is Bravo Wing. Orbital bombardment has ceased. We're up next. Roger, Viking. Have fun down there. What's the status on the drop zone? Leap down the surface into Swiss cheese. Craters, fire, and mushroom clouds everywhere. The Rathi is still putting up resistance. War makes the universe go round, Viking. Keep their heads down. Out. Excaliburs, I was listening in. The mission will still proceed as planned. Roger, Chaos Leader. Moving proceed on. to next waypoint. I wonder if we'll actually be in the planet's atmosphere this time. Also, as cool as it is the Commandant leading from the front, that's a terrible frickin' idea. Especially in ship number one. Put him in number three or something. A little bit less obvious. Oh, 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 set foot on our soil. End of your race draws nine. There will be no redemption for the sin of your pride against the chosen warriors of Kira. What? They seem to be pissed off for some reason. Well, that usually happens when intruders start to set up shop in somebody else's home. Intruders, like, you know, us. Chaos One, did you pick up on that conversation? Fast movers, protect my Marines. Get us to the ground, and we'll do the rest. Yeah, yeah. Three percent, really? You're pretty close. You are not super close, but close enough. Oh, it's hard to see against that freaking background of that planet. That was awesome. 
it was okay. to drop. Marines, speed, surprise, and violence of action is on our side today. We will drop. We will fight. We will kick their ass. Some of your fellow Marines will die today. But no Marine will die today because he was unaggressive. Marines, kill on three. One, two, three. Proceed to next waypoint. You guys are scary people. Just wanna point that out there. In case you haven't realized it yourselves yet. Venom, we've got visual on the drop ships. They're ours now. Appreciate it. Excaliburs, we're a minute out. Sending you coordinates to the LZ. And I want plenty of covering fire all the way. Ninja, those Karathi plasma batteries. Who clicks north of that crater? Take them out! Assassin, we hit the LZ. Anything within five clicks of it, die. See, we've got the easy job. We just stay up here and shoot down Kilrathi fighters. Not that yeah. easy. Yeah, speaking of which, I'm picking up target. Looks like jet interceptors. Atmospheric type. Die, you furnace freak! Pretty speedy. I can't match the speed like this. That was awesome. Okay, that's funny, you guys. You guys are actually kind of tough. Take as many of these guys as I can, as fast as I can. Another one. Now the dropship's doing still okay. I don't get to kill these guys very often. If ever. So it's kind of neat. Okay, you don't seem like you're 
you're actually at. to actually leave Atmo, they can probably have more room for guns and armor and all those fun things. As long as you're shooting me, you're not shooting the dropship, so more power to you. Clear my line of sight. That's all misses I'm gonna get. <laughs> Goodbye. That's the last wave. Okay. All clear. Set coordinates to the next patrol point. Oh, really? Proceed to next waypoint. Well, I don't see any more... I don't think we're with the dropships anymore, so that's something, at least. Viking, how's the attack going? Ow. The attack's going well. All bunkers and triple A's are mostly suppressed. Marines are doing their thing and making good progress. Bollocks! Gatling battery! He's locked onto me! Assassin! Tell him to piss off! Got it. Lock and load on the firing line. Enemy ships incoming. Yeah, here they come. Oh well. More opportunities to get a rare kill. It's all about looking about the positive side of things, viewers. Leave me alone. Fly like the that you are. Is that a rear turret that's making that sound, or is that an actual ship? Okay, another one back here. Equalize shields. Now that I can actually talk a bit more, since I'm not focusing on escorting ships. Watching some of my videos here, I realize there's a lot of blank space when I'm trying to focus. I think that's a problem with all of my uh, space shooting LPs, though. I never really end up concentrating really hard. Oh, crap! Assassin just took a missile! Hey, buddy, can you read me? Are you okay? The assassin, what's the matter? Are you deaf? Comms must be out. Get closer for hand signal. Getting closer. There's no smoke. Slight damage. And from what I can see, yeah. He's currently flipping me the bird, so I guess that means he's okay. <laughs> Roger that, Ninja. Next wave is coming in, Major! Stand by! Bandit! 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 Coming in from space! Their IFF codes, they could be dropped by. Must be those friends Phalanx tipped us about. Delay my last message, uh, apparently they're all dropped by. Tools, every single one of them. They're like a pack of jealous ex-girlfriends. They just don't know when to let go. Wow. That's a lot of missiles. I would really hate to die right now. Yeah, you know what? Don't need honor, because I'm going to win. I could, uh, really use your help over here. Come 
can get some. That was a uh, early countermeasure, but oh, no headbutt. You guys want to dodge that? Is that on the front? Maybe you should have dodged a bit more, huh? No missiles are plenty of afterburner fuel. You're flying barns. Oh, there's my headbutt. Oh, I lost something on that one. Come on. More fighters coming in. Both space and ground. They're acting a lot more aggressive. A lot more reckless. A lot more pissed off? Excellent choice of words, young one. 17 countermeasures left. Okay, now I'm starting to get a little worried if these guys don't light up, light up a bit. Are they all... Are they all like the elites? Or? I could, uh, really use your help over here. Destroying you will be a pleasure, human. This is quite the furball here. Sorry, kill steal. Without life, so you know what? I'll take my lower honor and then be happy. There you are. There you go. Sorry, what? I did not hear that last bit. Something about, oh my god, I'm on fire and my fighter's exploding? I think that's what you said. Or, you know, whatever you guys have that passes for God. Great catnip beast in the sky, I don't know. Goodbye. What? 130? More like round one. Can't finish a round when your opponent runs and hides like a little bitch. Hey, Death Bang, you finally decided to show up, huh? Got tired of hiding behind your monkeys? Ah, <sighs> that jump thing. Sabah is not looking down on your race with favor. By the next moon cycle, your fleet will be destroyed. I wouldn't bet on that death bang, you Utak. Call me Utak again, and you will know no bounds of my rage, you filthy ape! Utak. Disgraceful human. Warmates, destroy them all. Grey Wolf, Sandman, Twilight, I want this bastard dead. This fight ends here. Once again, of course, I'm fresh out of missiles. Decent hull, but that doesn't really help me much with missiles. That thing probably has like... 3, 6, 9, 12, I don't know... 30,000 missiles, bro? Oh, yeah, he's after me. Of course he is. Okay. Well, let's do this. Someone's after him. You will be destroyed, foolish monkey! Do, 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 do. 
have all this shielding. until one of us dies. Probably gonna be me. No! Really? Really? Son of a bitch! Death Van gone again! Okay now, think Sandman, think. If he's cloaked, his shields are down. He can't use his afterburner or make any hard maneuvers in the atmosphere. It'll give him away. He's going way too slow. Well, we got just the thing for that, don't we? Grey Wolf, boot up the shiny thing. Powering up. Just give it a few more seconds. What? The shiny thing? I had the thing lying around, courtesy of my old special ops unit. That's what you guys at Special Ops call it, boss? The shiny thing? Look, we don't need the exact technical details about it. Just know what it does. Well, what does it do? Well, apparently, it can detect atmospheric disturbances, including those of cloaked ships. Searching. Not picking him up. Wait. Got him. Barely registering. About three clicks. Grey Wolf, you're four o'clock low. Judging by the rate of closure, I'd say he's doing about 300 clicks, sending you the coordinates. Got him. Manual laser lock initiated. Radar slave laser. Single pulse, full output. Ping Mac got his attention! Okay, he's starting evasive maneuvers, but you've got him like a fish on a line. I've got his comm channel open. Go ahead, reel him in, boss. Hey, Fleabag. Your war idol Sivar might hate us humans, but he must hate stupid Gilrathi even more. Oh well, such is life. This is dishonorable. How did you find me? Once you recognize the pattern of the enemy, you can adapt to it. And your enemy is toast. Your pattern is predictable, Death Fang. One can only cloak and hide for so long before we develop a countermeasure. This will slave to the laser lock. Ready when you are. Please tell me what you use. You dishonorable, filthy weakling. I used a shiny thing. Goodbye. This time, for real. Alpha wing. Fire on my signal. Fire! Fire at what? My controls not responding. We will be with you forever. You shall have no peace. Finally! Rather anticlimactic, if I do say so. I tracked the trajectory of the debris. At this angle, it will just slide against the mountain. Well, that takes care of the cremation. Excaliburs! A new wave of my marines and a fresh squadron of fighters have entered the area! You are relieved of duty! Roger that, Chaos One. Viking, you get that? Got it. We'll be a few minutes behind you all the way. Bravo Wing, knock it off, knock it off, knock it off. Return to base. Okay, guys and gals, set the autopilot. Let the computer do the rest. Proceed to next waypoint. Oh. I'm glad to see that guy dead. Thank goodness for the shiny thing. Please don't have the Hermes be under attack. Computer configured back to zero G flight. Thanks for all the assistance down there. 
We got the LZ secured and we're dropping in more troops. The place will be totally under our control within the hour. I'm going to patch you in with the commandant. He wants to say something to all of you. Hoorah, Colonel! And bravo Zulu to the Galahad Squadron! It's people like you that make me want to apologize for all the bad things I've said about Flyboys. You really pulled through for us today. You hung really tough. As tough as my devil dogs. And more. The Marine Corps will never forget what you did today. Till next time, God bless and Semper Fi. Ura, yut yut, devil dog, Marine Corps, Semper Fi. Do jarheads have any other words in their vocabulary? Okay, okay, can it, Twilight. The man was trying to give us a compliment. All crap, autopilot activates. Proceed to next waypoint. <sighs> That's a win. A rough one, but a win. Ooh, more kitty litter. <laughs> I'm hot today. Return to formation. Roger that, Colonel. In four. Roger that, Colonel. Maintain radio silence. Colonel, I'm picking up some Terran radio comms, not picking up any other IFF codes in the area. Probably electronic interference due to us being near the planet, so we're bound to have intermittent contact. I wouldn't worry about it. Proceed to next waypoint. Ha! <laughs> I think Venom just swept some more information under the rug there. Smart. And chatter from the special ops team delivering the Templar bomb. Mission complete. Need clearance, TCS Hermes? Galahad Squadron, the Admiral has something to say to you. Stand by. Galahads, the Marines have taken the planet and are digging in. We also have reports from the other fleets. The Rathi eased up on their attacks, giving us enough time to regroup. Good job, all. Don't say that just yet, Admiral. Kilrathi are going to realize what just happened, and that they still hold the advantage in numbers. Then we'll really be in for it. No matter what happens, we did our job. We'll plan as we go. Get them home, sweetie. Galahads, landing clearance is in progress. Stand by. Okay, I love to hear you guys talk and all, but we need to be ready when the Kilrathi come back. They're gonna see our fleet's retreat, and magically come to the conclusion that we're vulnerable. We did more to the Kilrathi than they did to us. That's all I need. Hey, Assassin fixed his radio. Welcome back, buddy. Shut up. I just pretended to be deaf so I didn't have to listen to you over the comps. Uh, come on, we all know about those Better Homes and Gardens magazines you've been stowing in your flight bag. What's the matter? Too afraid of cracking one of those things open and reading it in pilot country? <laughs> I'd like to see you try that. <laughs> there should be plenty of cats to go around for all of us. Oh! Blank, you okay? All oh, right, arms hurt like hell. I'm controlling the stick now with my left. And Avatar says something totally sexist. The Felix looks like you won't be spanking the monkey anytime soon. Shut up, Avatar. I say let the cats come. Hey, we vented Death Fang, right? Yeah, that scumbag. You can take on anything. You're all still under the combat high. Just keep it under control. You want to use it, no problem. Just don't let it use you. Galahad Squadron, you're first in the shoot to landing. Nice chatter. I got the right ship, Hermes? Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Ugh. <sighs> really glad he's dead. First off, congratulations on Deathfang. He has been a thorn in our side for far too long, and eliminating him is a considerable victory. With all we have lost today, we need to allow ourselves a few moments to appreciate our accomplishments. We have one less Kilrathi Ace to worry about and many brave Confederation pilots have been avenged. However, a few moments to enjoy this victory are all we can spare. Galahads, I'm providing you with a confidential update on the fleet situation. During your last mission, General Taggart sent Admiral Merkin a message. The victory was successful in inserting the Templar strike team into the Kilra system. We have no idea of their progress, or if they're even still operative. However, it seems likely we have done our part in drawing as much attention 
onto ourselves as we can. We have successfully supported the Marines in their conquest of Freya too. There is still a considerable amount of Kilrathi presence there, but the planet belongs to us. We are going to need it for the next phase of our operation. I know you have all given your best today, but we each will be called upon to get even more. Take what little time we have now to get some rest and prepare to receive new orders. Dismissed. Well, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to see if I can borrow some of uh, those Home and Garden magazines. Deathfang's dead! Protected all the marine ships. I'm surprised there's nothing in here with a nice little medal, but another day on the job, I guess. 62 kills. Oh! 1,008! We made it, viewers! 1,000 kills! That's ridiculous. <laughs> and 175 assists. Well, I'd say that I finished what I start then. Anyhow, viewers, thank you for watching, and when we come back, more Let's Play Wind Commander Saga The Darkest Dawn. Apparently, it's going to get even tougher. I'm excited! So excited! See you then, viewers.